back in Bangkok. Our first stop of the day was 7-Eleven to get one of the famous ham and cheese toasties and now we're heading to the Grand Palace. So we're on our way to our next temple. We've just had a little refreshment. Cool down a little bit. No, thank you. Hi, How are you doing with the heat, Laurie? Don't you want any mango? <laughs> no, I don't want any mango. Heat. Um, yeah, I think it's just because our most recent trips have all been cooler climates. So like Iceland and then Vienna was super rainy. Um, so I just don't think we've been to like this sort of heat up for ages. No, and we're still so. getting used to it. But we're enjoying it. Oh yeah. We love Thailand, we love Bangkok. But yeah. it's just Bangkok has been so good so far. So warm. So our next stop is the temple where the reclining Buddha is. I think it's one of the biggest reclining Buddhas in the world. So I'm really excited to see it because we've already been to our first temple this morning. As we're making our way down, there's quite a few people sort of harassing you saying the entrance isn't here, the palace isn't open. I don't know, it's all a bit strange. Apparently it's this scam that they do with tourists where they want you to go with them to this store and I don't know, it's a bit strange. So as long as you're careful, then you'll be absolutely fine. But yeah, really excited to go to our next temple. Okay, so the heat has defeated us for today, but we've had a really nice morning slash early afternoon. Yeah, it's been lovely, really nice. First impressions of Thailand? Ah, oh, amazing. It's so beautiful. And it's not just the actual city itself, it's all the smells of the street food, the really vibrant colours. Uh, it's amazing. So we're going back now to our hostel. We're going to grab some ice cream and some cold drinks along the way. Yeah, and then just chill out for a few hours with the aircon on for. Uh, and then head back out this evening. Yeah. Thanks. We'll catch you later. We're cutting it a bit fine. But I think we yeah. might just make it. But made it just in time. Yeah. What time is it? Oh, it's 59. It's 19.59. Yeah. The show starts at 20... Well, well 8, 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock. I'm not convinced it's definitely this right this time though because on the website there's loads of different times so I'm not entirely convinced but we'll see in about one minute's time. Apparently these fountains won the best fountain awards 2019. I didn't even know there was a fountain awards. I didn't know this was a thing, but I can see why. Congratulations. Congratulations, yeah. Woo! That was nice. It was 20 minutes as well, which was quite a long time for a, a fountain show. And a beautiful skyline behind as well. Really nice. Yeah, we weren't sure about coming here, but I'm really glad we did. Yeah, but now it's time for the street food. There's so much choice here. I think we're going to have to make several trips around the indoor market, including the floating market indoors, just to decide what we're going to have. But first, we've gone for a barbecue steamed pork bun. Nice. Um, I think I like it. Yeah. 
think you'll really like it. Tasting. Next up is my choice, which is Korean fried chicken. We've got this like white sauce on top. Not sure what it is. She didn't want to give it to us at first, which makes you think it's going to be spicy, and she didn't think we'd handle it. So. She gave the lady in front of us like loads. Yeah. Yeah. See what it's like. Is Korean fried chicken spicy? I think the sauce is slightly spicy, yeah. not too bad. Yeah. As I speak, it's getting a little bit spicier. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared. But it's, it's fine, it's still nice. So the plan was we're gonna get one more savory thing, which we've gone for spring rolls, as picked by Matt, and then get something sweet. But the time is now quarter to 10, the market closed at 10. We just tried to get coconut ice cream but they said closed so I don't know if we're gonna get dessert tonight but anyway we're gonna finish on some spring rolls and see what happens I think they're veg spring rolls I don't think they're, they're meat and then we've got a sweet chili dip with them mm. Mm. nice ah, crispy. favorite thing of the food tour mm. I want to say just being here, it's just like, um, say it's a shopping centre, it's, I don't know, it's just really immersive and amazing. Mm. And to say we weren't sure about coming here, because it's it essentially a, a shopping centre or a shopping mall, um, it's been really good and I'm a bit upset that we run out of time and we can't spend some more time to explore it, so I think allow at least kind of three, if not four hours here but definitely come at evening so you can see the light show. But I highly recommend you come in. <laughs>